person, no enemy, nothing can push you down. Not unless if you just allow it. The king of Babylon threw Daniel into a den of lions. This guy Daniel had faith in God and God would command the lions to shut their mouths until Daniel and the lions in the den were just like buddies. David was just a young boy and nobody really cared about his challenges in the fields. Every morning he would be sent to tend the flock. And you remember, even his own dad almost forgot him during the anointing. Yet, David was the guy whom God had chosen as the king over Israel. Many years later, during the fight against Goliath, his own brother would confront David and ask, what have you come to do in the affairs of men? Aren't you supposed to be down there tending the floor? Who is taking care of the sheep? And Goliath was a gigantic man. He was a big man, so huge, experienced. He was there cursing God and demeaning David and his tribesmen. God worked up. He is a man who had no experience except fighting with animals. No military background. But he, David, just knew one thing. I mean, a 
an already fixed match, we already know the outcome. You become more than a conqueror. Hear that? Not just a conqueror, you're more than a conqueror. You can do all things, and by that I mean all things. You can raise the dead. You can heal the sick. You can heal cancer. You can pop blind eyes open. You can heal the deaf. You can be an employer. You can run multi-billion companies in this world. You can do all things because he strengthens you. But here's the catch. Do you believe that if God be for us, nothing can be against us? Do you believe that? 